The Arthur Pecaniot Clock Company (1904–1941) is notable as the longest-lasting Canadian-based clock manufacturer. Company advertisements explained the pronunciation of the name as Say Peganaw. The family of Arthur Pecaniot immigrated from Switzerland in 1874, and initially started a business of importing watches for the local market in Berlin now Kitchener, Ontario. By 1897, the family started bicycle production, but switched their focus to clock movements in 1904, and later started making their own cases. By 1941, the demands of World War II armament makers for brass, the essential ingredient in clock movements, pressed the company to stop production. The company distinguished itself as a competitor for some of the better American pendulum clocks, such as those made by Seth Thomas. Their clocks often looked like models made by Seth Thomas or Sessions but some of their designs, especially the tall mantel clocks, were unique. For their wooden cases, they favored the heart wood of quarter sawn white oak that showed off beautiful ray flex. The designs often had elements of the arts and crafts movement which also favored quarter sawn white oak. Most of their model names were based on Canadian cities. According to the Canadian Clock Museum, approximately 65 catalogued models of mantel clock are known, as well as 16 models of wall clock with variations and 7 models of grandfather hall clock. Rare samples exist of Pecaniot clocks built into a sideboard, or a grandfather clock gramophone combination. Pecaniot was also instrumental in the production of parts for the Franco-American Clock Company whose clocks mimicked the German box or Vienna regulators. Today, their clocks are highly collectible in Canada and command twice the price of similarly styled clocks by well-known American counterparts. One of the aspects that interests collectors is the high number of variants. Collectors can hunt for time only, time and strike, or either of these with calendar. The company seemed to start a run with one style of trim but then would complete the run with a different style, so that it is not uncommon to find a unique sample that no one else has. The Canada Science and Technology Museum's collection includes more than 80 Pecaniot clocks, mostly acquired in 1975. This particular collection of clocks is the second largest of its kind in a public collection. The largest private collection, of over 170 models is held by Skip and Karen Kerr in Edmonton, Alberta and represents over 30 years of collecting.